right, well, I did the big top, and this is what I ended up with. Now, I did leave some of those bangs, and I left a little bit of, like, brains back here. Um, and I am glad I bought those wigs. Boy, howdy am I ever. This is going to take a little getting used to, but let me see if I can turn sideways with this and show you the back. And, um... Uh, Bit of like fringes right here and over here. It also comes down on my neck a little bit. Um, and that's kind of bouncy, I guess, right there. It's just very healthy hair. I mean, this is super short. I thought I had a lot more uh, new growth there than I did, and I'm glad that I. Uh, stopped and regrouped and went to the bathroom to see what the heck was going on because I had to kind of straighten things up a little bit. I was trying to cut it in here and and oh boy did I cut it and I did video it and all I did was grab stuff and start chopping. But anyway, it'll grow out nice and healthy. My husband's going to have a shed attack. Sees this in the morning. Like what the heck were you doing? That's why don't <laughs> so anyway, I can live with it, I mean, definitely, and I'm happy that at least it's all down to pretty healthy hair, and, you know, this is my natural white hair right here in the front, and then a little bit of blonde left, a little bit of blonde left on the tips, but, I don't know, that's it, the big top, I did it, and I, I didn't cry, so I guess I survived it, so be brave, if your hair is dead and yucky on the ends, just cut it off, and you can start from scratch, going to grow back. I guarantee it. Alright, well that's it. Good job. Bye-bye.